And joining me in the studio to talk about takeaway lunches, I'm talking with the St. John's United Church Brockville Chair Outreach or Reach Outreach Outreach, Outreach Chair, which happens to be Elaine Kennedy. Elaine, welcome. Thank you very much. Thank so you. tell our viewers, what what is this takeaway lunches? Okay, so it uh, for years and years and years, our church put on a fifth Sunday breakfast for years. Okay. Well, then COVID came yes. and we were shut down and unable to do this. So we thought of how could we do something, bring something to the community, and of course with all the precautions and everything with COVID. So um, it, we discussed it and we came up with uh, free takeaway bag lunches. I like that so, idea. Yeah, so anyway, so, um, and then of course, when we were doing the free breakfasts, some of the people were bringing, our congregants were bringing in some clothing and uh, then they, they were out there for the whoever was there to take. So we decided to uh, incorporate that warm Good. clothing as well, or uh, clothing. Mm -hmm. And uh, so anyways, uh, we have, um, we make up about 45, 40 to 45 bags of, of lunch and it's all donated by our uh, people in our church, uh, volunteers. Yes. And not only making sandwiches or baked goods, or purchasing drink boxes and candy, and they, there's always monetary gifts that come, and yeah. so that mm -hmm. makes up that for helps. things. So it's uh, just wonderful. So we we um, we do the fall, uh, the last Saturday of a uh, month, and uh, from twelve till one. That's when we offer it. It's, now, only, it's it, only for an hour. Then it's it's usually just the hour, uh -huh. uh, but you know we're. We're, oh, yeah, we, we're open to mm -hmm. opening. If somebody comes earlier, of course, they're right. welcome. And, uh, but yes, yeah, so 12 to 1, the last Saturday of the month at St. John's Lower Hall, as a rule. And, uh, you know, we sort of stream them in and they can take a one or two bags of lunch or sometimes they have uh, people that they want to pick up right. and take or, two. Yes. And, they're f and we have clothing available, especially in the winter time. Um, we have uh, coats and mitts, uh, either handmade or store uh, bought um, and uh, boots and tops and sweaters and <clears throat> we've even had sleeping bags and um you know so it's some of it is donated well most of it is donated by our um family mm -hmm. of our church yes um but we were very fortunate <clears throat> a year and a half ago to uh, or maybe it's been two to uh, have a local retail clothing store uh, contact us and ask us would we take uh, clothing from them and of course we're just so thrilled well, yes. uh, and they have been providing us with a beautiful brand new clothing uh, sweaters uh, coats as a matter of fact we're just picking up three more boxes of clothing and I, I think amongst it is about 20 brand new Clo wow. coats and stuff. So it's just wonderful. Really, it is. So now we're talking um, are we adults. We're uh, 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 well, coats for adults. Most of, the, most of yes. it is for adults. So yes. We do have a few smaller items, you right. know, for, for uh -huh. children. Some some uh, family members have knit some, you know, nice warm items. knitting. Mm -hmm. or, or, and, and there's some socks. It's whatever we have donated, we put out and they're welcome to, to take, take what is yes. there. Yeah. Do they ever ask you if you happen to have, uh, do you have any more mitts or do you have yes. any more yes. socks or yes. something like that? Yeah. Yeah, are, and are socks a big th socks are a big yes item? they are yeah, yes they go fast they go fast and uh, yeah and it's nice I guess uh, the the wool socks are really appreciated mm -hmm. yeah yeah so uh, nice no it's toasty. just uh, yeah I'm just always amazed at what. Uh, I come around to to put out by the end of the month what's got you know what people have donated and we gather up and it's all put out um, and the reason um, now some of the clothing we have is not a sort of appropriate for the winter months mm -hmm, right. but at the end of our uh, time in March, whatever we have left over, whether it's uh, for whatever reason. Um, it go, it'll go to probably the the street friends. Oh, 
Good. Yeah. Good. It's so going to be used. Be, yeah. Oh, it's all used. Yeah. 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 And nice. all of our, if, if our sandwich, our bags of sandwiches and goodies are not taken, um, they get taken at the end of the day. Uh, to the uh, cooperative care yes. center. Yeah. Yes, yeah, that's nice. Yeah, that's so nice. no, it's yeah. it's uh, it's all used and it's all donated. So mm -hmm. it's just and the and also the people who volunteer to to come and help out. So yeah. do you have a committee that that helps you? Well, we have a an outreach committee, and. Uh, and also, I always say we have honorary members because, <laughs> <laughs> you know, some of our outreach people aren't able to make it. But, but I, it's it's for everyone. You mm -hmm. know that in the in our church, I say you're all honorary members. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, so yes. because yeah. they're so giving. Oh my and goodness! And just because I can't be there that particular day That's doesn't mean exactly, anything. exactly. I mean, they're yeah. still giving. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So and so, how I would imagine that that um, you do have repeats. You you get oh, to yes. familiarize yeah. yourself yes. with different individuals. Yeah. Um, do do you have a lot of new people that that? Well, we're starting to have some more new people coming out. Um, which is great. Yes. Um, and uh, but we do have a lot of repeat people coming, and it's nice. To, it's nice to see them come back. And and, and do they like to talk? And they just well, sit they, with you they for a minute? yes, they do. They like to share their little bit of history, mm -hmm. even with our church. Some of them have been to our church, or their parents were married at their church, yes. or you know they had somebody. There's always sort of a little bit of connection. Um, and uh, yeah, so we have a little conversation and talk, and it's it's really lovely. That's nice. Yeah. So with the lunch, uh, there's a sandwich in the yes. bag. Yes. There's a sandwich. We have a drink yes. of some sort. Uh -huh. We have uh, whether cookies or muffins um, or squares, mm -hmm. um, and we have a fruit, and we have some kind of little candy yes. or something to put in, That's and that nice. sort of thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that's so, yeah. yeah. And mean. the sandwiches are, as I said, are varied. Yeah. You know, what I always say, somebody says, what sandwiches do you want? Yes. And I said, whatever ones you bring. <laughs> exactly. So, yeah. So exactly. we we do an assembly the morning of, uh, uh, you know, people bring their sandwiches or their, their, their baked goods and whatever to the church. And then in the morning, we have kind of a little assembly line in our kitchen and uh, we put it together. Yeah. That's so, awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and and do um, uh, do the individuals that are, are dropping by to get the takeaway lunches and, and maybe I don't know a pair of socks or something? Mm -hmm. um, do they thank you? Do they say, oh, you know, we really, really, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't be eating today? Well, I I I I think that they they don't oh, not a lot of that, but of course they they're they're th they're always yes. thankful and very polite, mm -hmm. um, but. Um, you know, sometimes more, some of them are just there and they're shy. Yes. And, yes. you know, they're not, yeah. you know, but, but, uh, you know, you know that you're doing something. It gives you a, a wonderful joy. joy. And yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So this is only done then for the fall and the winter. Well, yes. And it, that seems to be what we've, we've done this for the last few ye years. And, um, you know, we're just a small little church. Um, doing a little bit of something and uh, but we're just a small part of what all goes on in Brockville because so many of the churches and organizations are there they're yes. doing a wonderful wonderful job yeah, so we absolutely. just try to do a little bit of our uh, part mm -hmm. you know well, so I'm sure it's well appreciated yeah. uh, so the next two dates then would be the, February 25th that's correct and yeah. March 25th, 25th. Okay. yeah oh, it just happened to be yeah 25th. just that yeah <laughs> yeah 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 so. okay so it's from one until two on the 25th no well, one noon it's from noon till, till one. one sorry yeah yeah <laughs> and uh, they can just come in and, and yes uh, yeah and yeah. I had a phone call there a while back from somebody from Iroquois and they just wondered if it was just for the people in um, Brockville. And I said, well, you know, mostly because people can walk to it, to the church. And uh, But I said, if you happen to be in Brockville at those dates, I said, and you heard about it, certainly. Well, yeah, drop you, by. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, that's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you uh, and your committee for oh, what thank you're you. doing for uh, the Brockville community yes. because it is, it is welcomed, I'm yeah. sure. Thank you so much for this. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you for okay. coming in, Elaine. Really appreciate it. We'll be right back.